Greetings streamers, today we're going to show you how to set up Live TV on your Amazon Fire TV and Fire Stick. In this case we're using a Fire Stick, it's the second generation so it's not the latest one. And we have to go to the settings options in the main menu and look for the Live TV icon that comes with an antenna. It's very important for you to already have downloaded any Live TV app such as Pluto TV or Xumo TV. Uh, in our case, we're outside the US right now, we're in Panama, so we're going to try and see how it works. We're going to use Sync Sources, and we will pull the channels from Pluto TV. Right now, it will try to pull uh, Pluto TV from Latin America, since we're already outside the US. If you live in the US, you don't need to worry about the VPN part, but anyway, if you do live outside the US, pay special attention to that area, because we're going to explain on this video how to use the VPN for setting up the Fire Stick since it's already hard-coded to the US, as we have explained in our previous videos. Now you will notice that there's no live TV yet in the main menu and it has to do with the fact that since we're outside the US and we're not using the VPN, it's only pulling up those apps such as news and such, but it's not taking into account anything from live TV. If we press the button for Alexa and we ask for the channel guide or we tell channel guide, it will take us to the main menu in order to set up the live TV because it's it's knowing that it's not working since we're outside the US. So let's try one more step and show you, for instance, Sumo TV here in Panama. And if we try to access it, it will not play. So it's telling us, you know, it's outside the available location. It is only intended for the US. So we need to go out and set up our VPN. We already have it. You can get it on the links in the description of this video down below or in the cards that will pop up during the video as it, it is played. You can use any of those options. And believe me, this VPN is the one that we always use in all of our videos, so it does work, so no worries. If you're in the US, you do not need it. However, if you're outside the US, you will definitely need it. So let's try Sumo TV once more and see if it's pulling it. So we have to wait a few seconds for the VPN to actually uh, let the app to recognize our new location. And there it goes. It's pretty much set up for Miami. So it's believing that we are outside, uh, even though we're outside the US, we're still in, in the US thanks to the VPN. Okay, so let's go back to the main menu. And we will try to set it up again, the live TV option to see if it does work now with the VPN running, of course. So we're going back again to the settings options in the main menu and we're going to look again for live TV. I'll click on it and now we're going to try and sync the sources once more. In this case it's only Pluto TV because it's the only app that we have installed that does work where it's compatible with the Alexa and the Fire Stick channel guide. So we'll start to look and browse. Uh, remember that it has to now recognize the new Pluto TV region since we're using the VPN. It's going to take Pluto TV from the US. Remember that there's two Pluto TV, one for Latin America and one for the US. So if you are in the US and you want to watch Pluto TV from Latin America, you might want to get the VPN because you can still use it as a server for Latin America in order to get access to the Spanish content. So it's up to you. Uh, I always recommend it. But again, now let's see what has changed. And I'm pretty sure that the main menu will have some slight differences now that it does recognize the new content. And as you can see right there, when it says on now, it's already reading the channel sources from Pluto TV. So we do have access to live TV right now from the main menu on the Fire TV or Fire Stick. Now let's try using Alexa voice search and ask for the channel guide in order to acknowledge if it's working perfectly or if it isn't. So you can see that all the channels are pretty much loading right there on the main menu. So let's go and use Alexa channel guide and it will show us the channel guide with up to two weeks of programming or content. So let's wait for it. And there it goes. So you definitely need the VPN in order for Alexa and the Fire TV channel guide on the main menu to work if you're outside the US. And this is something very important because a lot of people are always arguing that you do not need it. But to be honest, you do want to have it because it does help you to get the most out of your uh, Fire Stick. So you can see the content is there. And it's pretty much working perfectly as we expected. Let's go and check out Sumo TV. 
I think that we cannot set it up yet because for some reason Sumo TV is not compatible with the Alexa channel guide. So that's the only issue. Maybe other apps will like YouTube TV or Philo, but those are paid apps. We're using the free ones. So later we will try and make a review about it. Let's see if it works. No, it doesn't have any settings on the menu option. So we'll Please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notifications whenever we upload a video. And please give us a like if you do find it useful this video. Okay, so now let's go and show you something else. We're going to go to the live section right there on the main menu. And you will notice that we can see the categories of Pluto TV already there, like sports or live sports. You got Pluto TV channels or content based on genre or shows so that's something good and you can also set up the channel guide right here from this menu as well and also make the settings so please don't forget to follow us on twitter and on facebook under we are on our streaming army and also on our main channel on youtube which is streaming army again thanks for watching we hope you enjoyed this video please give us a like if you did find it useful i know that a lot of you will actually enjoy it it's very simple and it's not difficult to set up live tv again if you're outside the us you definitely want to get the recommended VPN that you can get on the links in the description of the video down there or on the cards. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.